So to go to Power BI, I'm going to load a web app. You can use any application, any web browser. It can be on any platform. And you can log into PowerBI.com and you'll log in. And I have some different dashboards brought up. So we're going to start by looking at our vendor performance dashboard. And so you can open a dashboard by consuming one of the dashboards on the left in Power BI. There's a Power BI menu at the top when you log in. I can reset the menu. When I open Power BI, there's three main sections. There's dashboards, reports, and data sets. An end user will normally interact with dashboards first. So in this case, I'm in the vendor performance dashboard. And I can see a few different views. I have a graph showing on-time deliveries, delivery counts, and what percentage are late. I have just a couple percentages at the top right showing the late delivery percentage. I have an average days late by a vendor. And I have another graph here, and this is showing a few different things. It's showing the vendor, what's their late delivery percentage by vendor, and what's their average number of days late. And I can do some analysis. So let's talk through the purchase manager role through this program. I think we had a couple questions. Some of the questions that a purchase manager might ask, what vendors are delivering POs late? So if I look in the graph, I want to find out which vendors are delivering POs late. So I can use this bottom right graph, and I can go ahead and make this a little bit larger. And I can see, okay, if I look at which vendors have the latest, I can see all of these vendors on the right are delivering pretty late pretty frequently. But especially this vendor here, you can see they have a much higher delivery count that's late. So I can actually click onto this graph, and when I click on the graph, it's going to open up an underlying report for all this data. So now I'm looking at a specific report of those vendors. Yeah, so once you drill down, Dan, if we're in this screen, if we wanted to evaluate, let's say, time performance, which vendors are good, which vendors are poor in terms of performance? So if I look over here, I can see that this, I think this is mislabeled. This is the on-time percentage. This vendor is on time most of the time. So this is our highest performing vendor. And you can see these other vendors are typically late. So I can see which ones are late and what percentage of the time are they late. So I can see my Northwind Traders is my highest performing vendor, and I'm having a problem with all these other vendors. So I can find out what they are, and I can switch between different companies I have and view it for different companies. So each company might have a different late vendor or on-time vendor. So I can see this one looks like an outlier. They seem to always be two weeks late. So I can call this vendor, why are they always two weeks late? These other vendors, they're only late less than a couple days, so they're not as big of a concern. So what if I wanted to drill down and see some of the details about a particular vendor? So here, I can go back to my main dashboard. So if I click back on Dashboards, I can also use this program to ask questions and get some of the details. So for example, I can say Delivery Count. Delivery count by vendor, and maybe I want to make this a table, and just look at the total delivery count by vendor, and maybe I want to add something else. So also add in and and the late delivery percentage. So now I'm looking at the vendors, and I have a graph I can interact with, so I can see who's my best performing vendor which vendors are doing the largest delivery count. And I'm now at the detail level looking at the details. And I can actually pin this back to my main dashboard. And it's something now I can look at later to, to view the details.